Hi there and welcome to Nexus EHR. Our series of video tutorials will guide you through the many features of Nexus EHR and today we're going to guide you through the Encounter section. The Encounter screen has several sections that is essential in capturing the most important information about the patient before the provider signs off the patient chart. We have created a video tutorial for each section of Encounter which you can find in your YouTube channel, make sure to visit our channel, Nexus Clinical TV. This is the Encounter section of the EHR. Let's take a look at the information we get to see in Encounter screen and options available, starting from the top. Encounter type shows you the type of visit, encounter date, and time. Clicking on the arrow pointer pulls down all open encounters for the patient, and user can click on the desired encounter to bring it up. It also shows rendering physician's name, referring physician, has room drop down to in-room patient, and transition of care checkbox to flag the visit as referred. User also has Superbill and ERX button to get on the respective modules. The Encounter screen has a quick flotation navigation bar on the far right to easily move around the page without having to scroll through each segment. There are information that is made available for the provider at the top section of the encounter. These are history, allergies, risks, labs discussions, procedure discussions, and referral discussions. Clicking on the expand button at the far right of each segment can expand and collapse to look through the saved information. User can also check reviewed all box to mark all items as reviewed. Furthermore, we can just scroll through segments of the encounter, expand and collapse each segment for a quick view. CCHPI or Chief Complaint segment is for documenting the reason for visiting. Vital records all the information of the patient. ROS or Review of Systems segment is for capturing positive and negative symptoms the patient has. PE or physical exam segment is where physicians document their finding after examining patients. Diagnostic studies is for capturing physicians' interpretation of any diagnostic report received, x-rays, MRIs, etc. Active assessment is for documenting ICD codes for diagnosed problems. Medications is where a physician can review patients' current medications and can also write a new prescription for the patient. This segment is also where you can manage the e-prescription. You can prescribe and order the patient's medications directly from here. Plan notes is where a physician captures things done with patient during the visit, discussion, tests, etc., the future treatment plan for patient. Orders is where the physician selects CPT codes from Superbill screen services rendered in the practice and tests ordered outside. This segment is also where you can view the order super bill, where it summarizes all of the services rendered, tests and x-ray orders, therapies, and many more before it is billed to the patient's insurance or healthcare provider. And last, the patient document or discussion segment is where the physician can select specific educational documents and share with patients. It is important for provider to sign off chart note at the end of the encounter. After filling up everything from patient's encounter data, the provider can sign off the patient's chart. From the floating navigation menu at the far right side, click on the chart in the menu and it'll open the chart note. The chart preview summarizes everything that has been included in the encounter data. And since it is laid out in a text box, the information is editable and you can format it to your own accord.
The buttons here are self-explanatory. The sign off button signs off a chart note and saves final chart note as a PDF document. Close button closes the chart note window. If you made some changes in the patient's chart note, you can save the draft. Regenerate note button generates the original chart note. And lastly, you can print the chart note into a hard copy or PDF. That's an overview of the Encounter section and chart note. For complete and thorough tutorial videos of the segments in Encounter, make sure to visit your YouTube channel. If you have any questions, you can reach us 24-7 through our customer service support.